Hello everybody, today I'm going to share with you all everything that I've kind of been up to this summer because I haven't been posting as much and I feel like I am just extremely far behind from where I want to be. So I just wanted to update you all on why that is. So uh, the first thing that happened was I set this goal at the beginning of the summer that I was gonna like post a bunch and I like made all these plans for these videos I wanted to film and I filmed them all. Um, but I haven't been able to edit them just because I've been traveling and I recently went through a breakup and I moved to college and all of the social things that are happening in college right now, it's just been a lot and I haven't even started classes yet. So I have definitely been way too busy to edit all of the things that I have sitting on my computer, but that is like a goal that I have and I'm going to hopefully be posting every Saturday now. I'll definitely be posting every Saturday. so. From now on out you can watch my YouTube every Saturday. That'll be fun because I have a lot of things coming up. I just need to like point out that I have gotten a haircut. You can probably tell this. I've also dyed my hair and I'm slowly working to get white like the silvery white hair so we're gonna see how that turns out but um in the videos that will be coming up in the next few weeks I might not have this light short hair because I filmed them before or during Sweden so um, those things just so you know are like older videos once we get back to this is when I finally caught up to everything that I have been trying to do. So that's just a little fun thing that you can watch out for. My life has been kind of crazy recently just because I like got back from Sweden and I, I broke up with my boyfriend because it just wasn't really working for the both of us and I love him to death and I hope that we can still be friends eventually but right now that's just not like a thing in my life so that was something that kind of ate up a lot of my time because I did this whole self-destructive thing but now I'm good and I recently moved to college obviously so I'm in my dorm which I am probably going to show you around because I'm really proud of everything that we've done. Moving into college was really fun. I'm living with Grace who you've seen on my channel before when we did like blindfolded face painting and she'll definitely be on my channel because I we've made some plans let's just, we're just gonna leave it at that it's really cool living with grace actually I'm gonna be honest like we have slightly different personalities but there's so much about us that is very compatible that I just I'm really excited for living with her and I'm like not worried at all um, it's been really fun uh, this week we have this like we move in a week before like classes start and so we have this whole period of time where there's just a bunch of events and social things that you go to so we've just been going to like all kinds of stuff. Last night we went to see the newest Star Wars movie. They like had it projected on a screen and we all sat in the grass and watched it and that was really fun but I had a fiasco where I lost my double sticks because I put them on the back of Zach's car and we drove off. Zach and I had to like go back with flashlights and try to find them and somehow we made to find them which I can't even fathom but uh, that all kind of worked out. I'm very excited for college and that's been a huge part of why I haven't really been posting as much but I sat down yesterday and for like three hours just made this really intricate plan of like when I'm posting what so that I have deadlines for myself because I have a bunch of unedited videos that I need to work on. Um, so that stuff is going to be coming your way, as I've been saying repeatedly, because I'm really excited for it. That's kind of a synopsis of where I've been and what I've been doing. There's like, it doesn't seem like much, but it's been a lot um, the past few weeks. I have to point this out. Um, Grace and I got matching tattoos that say Royals. They're like KC Royals, but we got it in black so that when our hands hold, like, they kiss. That's that's what we did. Also, so we can sing Royals by Lord because we're tools. Anyway, um, yeah, so now I'm going to show you my dorm room because I'm really proud of it and I hope that you like it. It's gonna be a very um, non-professional way of me showing you around my dorm room, but that's just gonna be what it is. So, hope you enjoy and so this is an overview of my side of the dorm room. This is our mini fridge and our microwave and up here we have a shelf of like all of our food. Then you have my desk. Underneath I just have a few like uh, books and agendas that I need to read and my external hard drive and wires because college. 
And up here I have my makeup collection all in this nifty little uh, organizer from the, what's it called? The container store. I like it, it's acrylic, it's very pretty. And then I just have like my face brushes and cotton pads and a mirror. Hello. Over here I have my laptop and my keys <laughs> and uh, my headphones and perfume. And then this light, which is like a freaking spotlight, ready? It's touch, so I just have to like touch it. And it is the brightest thing ever. I don't know if you can really tell, but the difference is phenomenal. <laughs> Then I have my um, by the bed like nightstand thing I guess. It just has my lotion on it and my lip balms and sticky notes and medicine and my decision crystal and my glasses and a note of like to-do lists that I have. Up above my desk I have the books that I took with me for this semester. So these are the things that I have goals to read this semester and well, I, th I think I can do it. So that's kind of what's over there and that this really cool marble book in that I love. And then I just have printer paper and my art portfolio with all of my art utensils in there, which I took so that I could do watercolors while I'm here. Over here, I have my awesome Marimo pet, which I made a video about before and I've decided to name it Taro, or Taro. And then I have this planter without a plant in it. That will definitely be changed. And over here, I have a vase with a hat on it. Then we have my bed. So my bedding is from Urban Outfitters, the wonky grid duvet is what it's called. And I have this like really soft white blanket and this palm uh, pillow, which I'm adoring. Um, and I think that's also from Urban Outfitters. And I have a really fluffy body pillow because fluff. Um, right above it, I have this one-way picture, so it's from Ikea. It's like my favorite piece of art that I've ever seen in my life. And above it, I just have these little fairy lights. Underneath my bed, I have a folding rack for like drying clothes and a bin for bringing laundry back up and a hamper for dirty clothes. So like that's my laundry stuff. And then over there, I have a bag that I put my stuff in to take. My devil sticks are under there, and I have a chair that folds up. Over here, I have my dresser by the window. So this is a fan that I got from Home Goods that's like peach. And then I have a Newton's cradle. So that's definitely hype because I like Newton's cradles. And then this is Grace's cactus, which we are keeping right by the window for maximum light and this thing will eventually just be filled with plants. That's the goal at least. So right here I have my closet, which I put curtains up so that I can hide the mess. Um, I just have all my hanging clothes right there, all of my shoes down there. It's really hard to see. All my shoes, they're all very dark, so you can't really see them. Um, I have all my necklaces hanging over here on these little command hooks. And up here I just have boxes of things and that's where I keep my studio lights, which are out right now. Over here I have my like vanity thing that I share with Grace. It's outside of our bathroom, that's our bathroom, okay. And <laughs> underneath I just have like my shower caddy and then other hygiene things that I might need eventually, like tampons, because I'm a woman. It's pretty basic, but it's pretty cool. We have our bathroom, which is dark because I turned off the light. We just have like towel racks for our stuff. That's mine, that's hers. And then we have a very dirty dorm bathroom. <laughs> Yay! Um, when we got here, the shower liner was so bad that it was like ripped and yellow and gross that my mom was just like, okay, we're buying new stuff. So we bought a new shower curtain and liner and hooks because the hooks were rusty metal and yeah, that matches our tiles, so that's our bathroom. And the last thing I have to show you is this ingenious invention that we came up with, my parents and I, to hang a pendant light. Now, disclaimer, we probably shouldn't have put a hole in the ceiling, but it's okay because there's kind of already a hole there anyway, so we're just gonna like leave it like that. Um, but so this light was already here and it has this plug-in right there. 
so you can see something is plugged into it. And if you turn on the light, it will turn on that and that outlet. So we took a pendant light and ran a wire up it and ran it right here. So we just have this gorgeous pendant light above our room and it gives amazing white light so that we can actually do our makeup. So I hope you all enjoy this storm video tour and I will see you very soon. Bye.